Hey everybody, HB Gibson here, and I just came from a two and a half hour gaming session playing Alien Isolation. This is gonna take a little while, but don't worry, I will be playing other games in between. But we're not playing any games today. This is Saturday Night Chiller. Chiller. On the show, we take a look at random scary videos on the net and we react to them. And this is part three, the third and final episode of my special edition series where we take a look at episodes of the classic reality show, MTV's Fear. Now, if you haven't been following, MTV's Fear was a paranormal reality show. And it has been said that MTV's Fear was the first show to actually start the whole paranormal ghost hunter reality show thing. It aired in MTV in the early 2000s. It takes five to six contestants and puts them in a place that's supposedly haunted. Each contestant is sent on a dare or a mission to investigate certain areas of said haunted place. And if the contestants do succeed in pulling off all the dares and missions, they each win a pretty sizable amount of cash. This episode is probably my favorite episode. Why? Because the ending is ridiculous. So follow us on this episode of Saturday Night Chiller, where we take a look at episode 11 of MTV Sphere, Mina Dos Estrellas. Here we go. Nau, a sorceress creature of Mexican folklore capable of changing into predatory beasts of the night. Mm. They say there's someone taking care of the entrance, some creatures. Wow. Please, hey, hey man. Please, please. What's wrong? What's they're wrong? still here. Their spirits are still screaming to get out now, of here. Now, there is a reason why this is Those my favorite episode. As I said earlier, the oh, ending is ridiculous. Please. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah. I'm telling you, there's something in the bottom of my stomach that's not right. I'm Oof. Telling you. I'm not the one who so far away with my fear snake by enter my ring and he never, never wanna be here again. And I don't know, man, why I came. Okay. <laughs> My name's Jose. I'm in Oakland, California. I'm 20 years of age. I got too many bills at home not to win. <laughs> I'm Victoria. Hey, Victoria. I'm from Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. She's a, ho she's a Hooters girl. <laughs> Victoria is in the house. <laughs> yeah, and those ghosts are in the house. My name is Zach, 22 years old. Zach. I'm from Greenville, South Carolina. Greenville, South Carolina. Yeah, yeah buddy. The rest of the guys, the rest of the girls, get to know new people. And I'm ready to have a blast. How about y'all? Yeah, yeah, buddy. Hey, Sandy. I'm 19, and I like long walks on the beach. <laughs> I came to be a part of MTV Fear, the first international episode. As a personal the quest, it's too international late to get back episode, out, yeah. I'm all or nothing. My name is Dave, and I'm 18 years old. So far, I'm having a good time here in Mexico. See where this adventure leads. Yeah, buddy. And it's going to be very, very interesting where it does lead. I'm 20 years old and, and I'm from Miami, Florida. It's a promise. I'm going to go through it. Yeah. You're ready to go to Mexico and you're going to get your pants scared off. <laughs> I'm not trying to disrespect nobody's uh, 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 accent or anything like that. You know, I'm just, just having fun. <laughs> 
is one of the lineage of the Aztec traditions. You come here to Mexico. You come from another culture. Now you've been here in a natural forest, a natural power. In a few minutes, you join to the darkness. The Nahuali energies, the Nahuali power is here. If you want to enter, you need to open and expose your bones. Your bones. You need to die. You need to change. If you want to find these energies, your fierce enemy is yourself. Well, you know something, I'm gonna tell you something. In spirituality and also in, in Christianity, he, he's pretty much the same. It's, yeah, pretty much the same, you know. The, uh, you know, you, you have to die to self in order to really, you know, be a part of whatever spirit that you're letting yourself go to. Me being a Christian, you know, I had to die to my own self uh, to actually fully, you know, accept God, you know, fully accept Christ, you know. It's kind of freaky. So it's, it's very interesting. That's the safe, wow, that doesn't look like a safe house to me. <laughs> but that's the safe house. Now find the black Velcro fastened pouch Inside are six color patches. All right, let's everybody get a color. Wouldn't it be green? Yellow. Back with the H is blue. Yeah. Tasha's white. Me purple. Jose is green. Dave is red. Okay, so you know each each uh each contestant is uh, given a color. We're all gonna try to make it. I'm just checking my checking my sounds here. Welcome to Lamina dos Estrellas Mine, built in 1903 by European gold diggers. This mine soon fell prey to the wrath of the legendary creature called the Nawal. Uh. This was one of the richest silver mines in the whole world. Oh yes, yes, this mine was very successful and made many people very rich, but all of this wealth came at a very, very high price. Mm. Nawal was angered by all the greed that went on here. A Nawali is somebody who can shapeshift. They can dream powerfully enough to become another animal. Mm. It could be a coyote, it could be a black dog or a wolf. He controlled and manipulated nature to such a degree. The rains were torrential, sending a massive flood through this whole mine. Mm. Thursday, the 27th of 1937. It rained for days, causing the dam to break. And then the floods came like a monster through the mines, killing more than 400 people here. Suddenly I realized that the cart was bringing out dead people instead of gold. After the flood, the miners that were left sealed the cave and closed down the mine because they felt that all the bad things came from the Nawal, who may have been living at the back of the cave. He is a figure that appears at night. He is lord and master of the night. It is a devil in person. He appears. He transforms. He invites you to look for that treasure. Why? So he can take you to look for it in hell. To mess with mm. this energy before you're prepared is to court disaster in a very serious way. Your objective over the next two nights will be to determine whether the Nawal still haunts this mine. Your investigation will take you to several locations where paranormal activity has been reported. The chapel, oven room, hospital, carpenteria, drainage, Yo, modellus room. Imagine if tunnels. you're one of the contestants you and the, if you do, this you computer overlay right here. Another team member must complete <laughs> your dare. You must begin now. Good luck. <laughs> that computer overlay and that voice. Green, you must begin one. now. Oh, All right. Um, are you going? Yeah, I gotta go. Okay. I'm white. Okay, you're navigating. Yeah, the navigator stays in here. Dude, we're supporting you. Don't. We can do this. Let's be the first team to do it all. Green, investigate the chapel. White will navigate. I'll be getting scared just so everyone knows. All right, Jose is going now. Yeah, you guys are going to see the reason why this is my favorite episode. I mean, the. Exit safe house. This episode is. Wow. 
You think the first episode was crazy? This one is. We're in it. He's outside, man. It's raining. I don't think the dares are as terrifying as the first one, but maybe just the the vibe of it is just scary. What am I supposed to do? Oh my god, you guys. Whoa. How do you feel? Scared as hell. Onto the porch of the Iglesia. Come on, I'm getting scared. Yeah, it's getting rainy out there too. Open the door. Into the chapel. Yeah, I mean, imagine that. I mean, like, you're, you're having to pull off this dare and it's raining. I don't think any of the other dares I've seen in any of the other episodes had rain going on. And we got a cross. And, and the cross is supposed to be a, a symbol of hope and faith. They brought Christian missionaries with them. This chapel symbolizes everything that the new wall opposes we made a cross and we put the cross at the entrance of the door so that the nawal could not come through because when they saw the cross they would flee mm. well you know what this hey listen the bible says uh in the name of jesus demons flee so <laughs> Of the cross. In order to draw the new wall to the chapel, you are now going to knock down the cross. No, oh, oh, oh. hold on, hold on, hold on. What am I supposed to do? Oh my God, you guys gotta okay. knock down the cross. He's knock it down. Wow. Knock down the cross. If if I, if they want me to proceed with it, I'ma quit. I'm telling y'all now. You can do it. You know that, right? So technically, oh, the if the faith down. behind the cross <laughs> falls. <laughs> He's going to really yeah. open himself up to total yeah, bombardment so of whatever evil spirits are in that place. So, you know, that, that cross is literally a shield. What am I supposed to use? As far as faith, you know. Push hard on it, your strength. You can do it. Well. Okay. Okay? No. Look, I'm starting to hear sounds. Oh boy. Jose, sweetie, you may return to the safe house. I'm hella scared. Ooh. Now, now listen. One of two things could be going on. It could be it could be some actual spiritual things happening, or there could be, you know. You know, the whole uh, uh, build up, uh, the instructions that you get on the computer, uh, the stories and everything, it, it gets into your head and then your head starts to play with you. you know. <laughs> well, he passed it. So far, so good. I don't want you to change the channel. They're both scared. He's already covered in blood. Covered in blood. Whoa. remember. Team members, white, yellow, navigator, blue. God, I want to go, I want to go. Yes, Natasha. Oh, wow. Oh, she, 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 she's like, I want to go, I want to go. She wants to go and investigate something so bad. And she's going to get the pants scared off of her. Be careful what you wish for, hon. I'm telling you. Dare two, white and yellow. Go to the oven room and await further instructions. Blue will navigate. Blue will navigate. I'm telling you, that the voice out of that computer is crazy. I see a passageway. Okay, let's walk together so we can both see. Where is Iglesia Passageway? Walk out of the mine tunnel. Yo. We have found the entranceway to Iglesia. Over. Uh, yeah, she's. These yeah. are some rough stones. She's. <laughs> She's getting scared. A pine tree in my face that does not 
the law. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Well, careful. Okay. Oh. I am dying here. Sorry, you don't know. No okay, problem. Baby? Yeah, I'm nervous. Okay. All right, don't be nervous, okay? We're, we're here together. We're going to do all right. Okay. Okay? Rock out. Grab hold of that. Yeah, man, rock out, carefully. man. Yeah. Carefully walk down those steep wooden staircase. Um, it's pretty stern steep. This and is... we're still going. We're doing all right. Tasha, baby, yeah. you doing good? Yeah. Tasha gives a thumbs up. She's rocking it out. <laughs> Yeah, man. We're See, if the I was there, room. I wouldn't. I wouldn't be playing no stupid tricks or nothing like that. Like, hey, boo! You know, no, no. I'm like, I'm like, yeah, man. We're going downstairs. We're good. It'll be nothing but encouragement. With all the accidents in the mine, they built their own hospital, but no one wanted to go there because they knew the Nawal would come for their blood. Woof. Good luck, baby. Walk until you reach a bridge that is high above a river below. Mm. Okay, I'm walking over the bridge. The sound of the water. Mm. Wow, I don't know about you guys. I'm freaking out. This bridge yeah. leads to the hospital. They should never even have attempted to build this hospital across this bridge. They let them know that they could not build their hospital in that place because it was populated by demons mm. and Nahuales. Then the people around here started fearing that hospital. So it was decided to close the hospital because no one wanted to be taken there to be cured. They thought they were going over there to heal. And actually, they were going there to die. Wow. Natasha, I need you to confirm that pathway along the back side of the hospital, baby. Over. Uh. What is uh, that? Uh, she's feeling something or hearing something. Now, I ain't going to tell you about the ending. In there, you felt it. It was so heavy. I just felt the electricity. You know what, you guys? I'm not doing this. Tasha, I don't want you giving up, sweetheart. You're doing wonderful. I'm done. I got cut. I'm done. Uh, just, I'm going to keep talking to you for, for a minute, okay? You're doing fine, okay? What What's going on? Are you okay? I just didn't have the power to go through over there. So come on back and meet up with, with Sandy there. Zach, I'll be honest, I'm thinking about failing. Um, we'll talk to you about when we get back. Okay, over. Ooh. You done already? Right? Baby, are you okay? Here. Yeah, hold on to me, okay? Is that okay? Sorry, Yo, I'm she got freaked out. Um, there's a lot of weird stuff going on down here. We're on our way back as quickly as possible. Did you hear that? Yeah. Uh huh. They're both scared to death, you guys, and they both of them heard something cool the entire time. Like they haven't even complained once about noises, and now all of a sudden, hey, Natasha, you know what I mean? See, once they broke apart, mm -hmm. that's what I'm that's saying. When they got I'm afraid the second I walk in somewhere over there, I'm gonna um, flip out. Cut, mm. I, mean, I know it's mental, but there is <laughs> out there. <laughs> there is <laughs> out there. <laughs> you better believe it. Hi. Thanks. Hello, ladies. How did everything go, guys? I was fine until it was very clear that I was very unwelcome. Like, I don't know if I'm tampering with something that that I don't need to be tampering with. I heard things falling. I heard, mm. like, Did you hear the clanging? This sh did done, guys. Really? Yeah. It's cool, man, you guys. You guys, I'm really sorry. Some stuff I know is better left alone. Like, it's okay. I know. Seriously. Yeah, it's fine, y'all. Okay. I'm, I'm sure I'm, I'm about to join y'all. <laughs> oh no. Two down. You guys, do y'all realize I'm the only girl? I thought they would make I thought both of those girls would make it to the end. Like we lost two, so us four can make it a show. Yeah. Scared the I am too, no man. Doubt. I'm See, callous. don't let like that's the thing. Don't let their quitting get to y'all's head. Dude, like, something's out there. Replacements mm. have been randomly been inserted. 
Oh, man. Green and red must complete the dare aborted by white and yellow. Purple will navigate. Hola. Uh, you know I gotta do it, right? Green and red must complete the dare aborted by white and yellow. Purple will navigate. MTV, just hire me to do the voice of the computer if you ever decide to do MTV Fear again. Okay? Green and red must complete the dare aborted by white and yellow. Purple will navigate. <laughs> Let's do this, huh? Dave. <laughs> okay, we found the, uh, Investigate the oven room. Down the steep wooden staircase. Blue is navigator. You're doing good, man. You're doing good. And they're both scared. We're walking down this ramp. Your next step is to locate a large crane winch to your right. And there's a large hook at the bottom of the winch with a bucket attached to it. Here's a bucket, dog. Hook and bucket uh, confirmed. Over. This is where, um, Jose, I'm sorry, bro. Red, uh, Dave, you must stay at the hook and bucket. Mm. And uh, I need you, Jose, to be heading to the hospital. Hey, you're going to be a Oh, man. <laughs> Dude, man. Investigate the hospital. This was this killed us last time. Walk until you reach a bridge that is high above the river below. At the bridge, Confirm man. your location. Copy. It, the eerie feeling in my in my body was like, you know, there's like there's something there. Mm. The old hospital building is on your left. Walk down to the first doorway on your left. Now, the previous episodes that we watched didn't have like uh, like a resolution by the uh, the contestants when they were talking about what they experienced. You are about to lure the new wall by placing flesh at these two active new wall locations. Dude, they full of blood. Whatever it is is all over me, this bag, and everything. Oh God, no. Hurry up, it's kind of scary over oh. here. Man, it's scary over here, dude. I mean, he's already covered in blood. He should just be able to take it out. Hey, uh, I'm coming back because I'm f***ing scared now. Jose, dude, you Nah, man, I hear some in the other f***ing room, man. Yo. <laughs> I'm out. He's out. Oh, man. This is so not good. Dave, are you out or in? Over. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's gone. Dave. I'm still in, man. Into the end. Copy. That is scary. Something's not wanting people here. <laughs> now you see? Something. Two down. One more is leaving. Hey! Wait up, blood, don't leave me! Hey, man! Flash your light, man, I can't see you! Just walk towards the light, hey, man. Hey, man, I don't know what that was, but f that, I'm not. <laughs> what the f was that noise, man? Yo, hey, man, I'm scared, man. they both that heard the noise. Me and, and closer, and I crossed the bridge, and I'm gone. Which way is up? I have no idea. You, you bailing? Uh... All right, I'm out. So, Dave, are you in or out, brother? Ooh. As of now, I'm still in. Over. Jose, you're you're done, and, and Dave, you're not. So, Jose, make your way back, buddy. Dave, remain there. All right, I'll wait here then, man. Dude, I'm hella scared to walk over there. It's cool, man. It's cool. Godspeed, my friend. Well, keep talking to me, dude. I'm f***ing scared. What the f What the f was that? <laughs> We're getting somebody out there as soon as we can, buddy. That. Talk to me, man. Woo. That. Dude, you don't know how loud. Hang on, bud. Hang on. Close. Just stand by, brother. I'm not. Dude, okay. I'm going to tell you, like, it was like banging in the second room. Boom, boom, boom. Footsteps. That goes to the next room, right where I'm standing. That's why I like, dude, I'm out. I'm out. That followed me across the bridge, and I f***ing bailed. That still over there in front of that door. 
Like, I did not think it was the new wall? I don't know what it was. I don't know. It's kind of funny, but it's not, because you never know, man. You never know. I was green, right? Well, nice to meet you. Okay. All right. Three down. Three to go. You're about to see the reason why this is my favorite episode of MTV's Fear. Oh, yeah. Blue must complete the dare aborted by green. Purple will navigate. Mm. So how you feeling? I'm so Dave is still in. And it's freaking the hell out of me, but... The other gentleman just left. Three left. Yeah. Dave, I'm coming to meet you, big boy, right now, brother. Dave, how you doing? Hanging in there, man. Just hurry up. I can't take this darkness anymore, man. See your light, man. Dave. I'm right here, man. Where are you at, buddy? I have no light. Right to your right, man. What's up? Hey, you, you doing all right? I'm, I'm sticking. I'm sticking through. I okay. can do this. Red must remain at the hook and bucket. Blue must leave red and continue on to the hospital. It's always at this point. It chased away the first two. It chased away uh, uh, green. Victoria. Now, you Zach. Are now standing in two of the most active New Orleans locations. Activities in each of these areas. I don't need to hear that right now. However, the markings are inconsistent with any animals of the area. What do you want me to do? Over. Hey, Dave, let's do this, shit, brother. All right. You two are about to lure the new wall to the Mina Dos Estrellas by placing flesh at these two active new wall locations. Blue, put on the latex gloves from your equipment pack. Then remove the large packet and describe to the safe house the contents inside. I got the gloves on, and it is a cow tongue. Let me say this, dude, because I was watching this show one time, and, uh... And I didn't really think it was legit. But now that I'm actually here behind this flashlight, staring into this, talking to you right now, I don't want you to change the channel. Because uh, I want you to just feel me for a moment. All right, I got, uh, it looks like a heart here. Uh, mm. Something is really bloody, though. Ooh. OK, here we go. I'm having problems. You have to put the cow tongue on the sign Woo. I'm scared. Oh no. I can't hear Woo. you repeat. You guys, we lost power. Did you guys read me? I read you. What do you want us to do? Dave. Now, just remain calm. whether the producers calm. did all this Every or not, in this place, the computer started going haywire it's still. And just, just think of yourself in that situation. Right my camera. I'm kind of in the same shoes you guys are right now. I'm all alone also. <laughs> Dave, how you doing, buddy? You, you heard that noise? I don't see how this could get any better. Victoria, where are you? I'm still in here, you guys. Something was outside of the place here. Because if the crew is playing jokes on them. What are you talking about? Something was outside in the mine tunnel. They're doing a what good job it? at it. Something. I'm not liking this at all, man. Not at all. But then I again, they got cameras you, all over the place. So they, you, you know, have, I th we would have seen one of them. Buddy, I'm sorry. Just hold on, guys. I'm, I'm in the same situation you guys are. I'm scared and I'm all by myself. That sounds nice, Victoria, but you're in the safe house, sweetie. I would like you to tell me some good things, okay? All right, man. We can do this. It's three of us, man. We all made it. It's cool. Hello? What the f What's wrong? What's wrong? I'm not here to upset anything. Please. Please. What's that right there? That's nothing, baby. That's a stick. Don't leave. Uh oh. It's about to go down, y'all. The lights are on. Did Pretty you soon, you? you're gonna find out the reason why right, this is my favorite episode. Can, oh, come on, those noises are coming back. Oh no. 
Okay, blue, remove the hammer and the nails from the bag. Place one end of the tongue above the hospital doorway okay. and nail it to the hospital sign. Nail it to the, to nail the cow tongue to the hospital Red, sign. Take the knife out of the bag and poke a hole in the center of the kidney. Then stab the kidney on the hook in front of you so that it hangs over the bucket. The kidney is in place. Return to the safe house immediately. You're done. Oh, thank you. Thank you. We're doing good, guys. All right. Boy, that is a challenge. You see my glow stick? All right, he made it through that one. You damn right we'll make it through this. Damn right, man. You know Hell what I'm yeah. saying? Hell yeah. It's all mental. Hell. But we can hear it. We can hear it. Hell yeah. Let's get the f out of here. <laughs> I believe in the afterlife. Like, here on Earth. Like, I heard all kind of shit. <laughs> it's nice when you're with somebody, though. Oh, yeah. How'd it go? Oh, that was intense, man. That was very, very... Yo, this so is sorry. what I heard. I'm okay. sorry. I heard people talk, like, this guy mumbling around me. And nailing a heart? No way. Yeah, nailing that tongue. That is definitely not a girl thing. I mean, look. Yeah. That's not a girl. I mean, I know I'm in the safe house, but it's still kind of scary when there are no lights except for oh, candles. It's very scary. Oh, I'm sure you guys were freaking out. Man. I was freaking out in here, too. Man. Oh, it's good to be back. That's all I could say, man. I don't know what to do. Yo, guys. when when the safe house doesn't feel safe. End of night one. Done. <laughs> Glad to hear that's the end of day one. All right. Get some sleep, y'all. Because the next day ain't going to get no better. <laughs> it's getting colder. When you can see your breath and stuff. Yeah. Something's not right. We're in like Mexico. We shouldn't be able to see our breath. It should not be this cold. Wow. Is it just me or is like, Is it why? blinking? Huh? No, see how you can't I mean I can't even like focus on it on Whoa, whoa, whoa. Huh? What the f is that? What? Yeah, that's not right, man. It feels like there's a glow from this. Yeah, but I'm saying mm -hmm. well, I mean it glows anywhere. Like look. Oh really? Well, actually, it doesn't. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. my God. Turn that around and go where it's glowing. Yeah, just get that on film, man. Get that on film. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Now, it's been said that cameras guys, I'm getting, like, can off, actually like, uh, uh, capture um, uh, paranormal oh, entities, uh, ghosts, orbs, that sort of oh, thing. Oh, my God, you guys. That is not okay. cool at all. Look at that. That's all over that place. Yeah. That whole wall is. That whole wall is Look. bright. But there's no light anywhere on that wall that it would be shining off of. You know, nothing's Dude, that this bright. This wall over is there. freezing. Put your hand up on here. This is amazing. You know, Jose was saying something was following him back. Yeah, he was for real, you guys. Yeah. Yeah, he was not lying. Yeah. Yeah, not he was playing he no was game. Footsteps and the footsteps were getting closer. He said it was following him all the way back. Yeah. To yeah. the mine. Through the right, tunnel. Right. Through the tunnel. This is no. And after after that, that's when all the strange shit started happening, you know? That's word, when the word. power went out. Yeah, it's like it's like somebody really did fall in. Yeah, right? and was mm. like, okay, this is where y'all are. Yeah, that freaks me out. <laughs> like, a lot of this stuff, I mean, we could just be talking up. You know what I'm saying? Though? Like, let's just know. think like that for a moment. But I mean, it's just a lot of coincidence. Yeah. So 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 Zach is like, you know, thinking the same thing that I was saying earlier. No, it all this could be just be playing on their heads or it could be actual anything spirits to, to do this Trust me, i told myself I'm, all, I'm not a quitter at all i'm no i don't quit anything yeah. ever and i don't either ever all right here we go night two Welcome midnight to night two dare three team members purple and blue blue and purple investigate the carpenteria red will navigate that's mm. me and you baby I don't I don't want to I don't want to be alone. Yeah, I mean, I'd be with you for a while. Oh my god. This is this a is lot huge. Of Yo, it, hey, it's it, 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 it's it's taken a real it. dark Here, turn right at this Why moment. I'm so nervous. I'm not even going out. And I've seen this episode a few know. times, but it's been a long time. Really but I know that this We're that this is, there is a very very dark turn separate. that this like I'm not going to that this episode is going to take. Okay? I am not going to leave you. I am not going to leave you at all. Okay, Dave, uh, give me the first report, buddy. Oh, man. Okay, exit safe house and walk out of mine tunnel. 
Okay. Walk straight from mine gate until you reach a metal shack in front of you. What's that right there? That's nothing, baby. That's a stick. Please, I'm really, I'm really scared. I don't know. Okay. I don't know, but I don't want to. I just want to walk back. You just want to go back? Please, I'll have to leave, but I just don't want to do this. Please. Let me just say this. My heart's pounding. How is it out there? Mine is too. Like, we're fine, sweetie. I don't want to see anything. I'm scared. I'm telling you, there's something in the bottom of my stomach that's not right. I'm mm. telling you. Trust me. I know how you're feeling because I felt the same way yesterday, okay? But I dug deep within myself and I. And I, I don't want to dig deep. I, know I you want don't. to go home. Okay, but listen to me, okay? Let me just put this on you. Hang on. Push your head back in there if you can. Cool. So just come with me, okay? There's no nothing. Like, we're fine, sweetie. You're with me, and nothing's gonna happen. Nothing is gonna harm us. Absolutely nothing. Where's the mine? Into the mine tunnel. We're, look, we're outside now, girl. Where do you look in the huh? sky? Just look. Right, look. Look at that. Dude, we're listen outside. to me. Damn, sweetie. I'm not gonna force you to do a thing, okay? As soon mm. as you wanna go back, which is gonna be probably in a few minutes, we'll turn around and go back, sweetie. The mine tunnel. I do. Oh. Oh. And this is the part where she crumbles. There's nothing to hear here. Seriously. Right here, there's nothing to hear. I just want you to experience just this little section right here. I just have a feeling that I'm not going to like it. Okay, we don't have to go any step further. I'm scared something's going to happen to me. How are you doing, Victoria? Uh, Victoria's doing fine. I'm just talking to her, just trying to comfort her. She's fine. Vic, please, please. I just can't go back in that room. You are brave for doing this. This is real, dude. Yep. Vic, please, please. You, okay, you want to just seriously just turn right around and go back. I'm Maybe. scared to death. I just want to go back. Okay. Mm. Dave, um, I think I think Victoria is 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 not up for this. You know, it's just too much. <laughs> Look at me. There I'm it is. Proud that you came out here with me. Okay. I mean, I feel like I should do it, but no, I'm scared to death. No, 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 I'm no, no. Scared. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Well, I'm, just... I'm just scared to Victoria, death. Victoria, I'm, I'm proud of you, though. Seriously. I wish I would have caught mm. father, but I just, no, it's yeah. in my stomach. It's I just fine, can't do it. Fine. So, Dave, me and you are going to knock this it's out. It's in the part of my stomach. It's just not, it's not right. Something's going to happen, you guys. Something's going to mess around with people. <laughs> Four contestants have quit. You're getting very, very close. One person. You're getting very, very, very close to finding out why this is my favorite episode. I did overcome that fear last night. Yeah. But dude, I mean, I know it's gonna happen again. Yeah. You know? And this time it's gonna be worse. Worse and mm. wilder. So do you wanna click out, man? Like and we can all go home with Victoria. I just I just dude. I just can't go back in that room. Yeah. Where I heard all that commotion. Right. I don't know if I can do that alone. Yeah. And that kidney is still hanging there. There's shit out there. There's there's things out there. Yeah. So uh, something can't. definitely didn't want us there yesterday. They made that pretty clear. They made that very And the fact that they hammered up all those organs up there and you know um throughout history uh, people have given body parts and full animals to spiritual entities as sacrifices. I think when they did that, they just drove whatever spirits are there absolutely ballistic. Here we go. Very clear. <sighs> I wouldn't be able to continue down those steps. Right. Man, I hate this shit, I really do. The decision. The 
dare. Man, you got you got some big balls for doing this, man. Yeah, tell me about it, buddy. And Zach You're makes his descent. Job, my friend. Hey, dude. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and be honest with you. I'm. I mean, I'm just. I'm not really freaking out now, but I just know. I understand, man. I know how you feel. I. I would not want to go back there. I. You are brave for doing this. Walk down to the stone steps to your right. Okay, I'm here, dude. But hey, I don't even think I can go down these steps, buddy. I really don't. Um, I've try I'm trying my best to dig down, and I'm gonna try to pump myself up for a minute, okay? <sighs> oh, man. Hmm. And he is trying on, so hard. There, like, he's trying He's I trying so here. hard to, to get some exactly strength, going, guys, some inner strength. Oh, man. Boy, I told. How you doing, man? Keep talking to me. I told everybody at home that I would, I would do this, shit and that I would make it, and that I wouldn't give up. But oh um, uh, my, with what I experienced last night, unbelievable, unbelievable. This is crazy. I'm just very nervous right now, buddy. Very, very nervous. Hey, you're doing great. I'm proud of you. We're all proud of you. I'm sure if. Anyone else was here, they would be proud of you too. I'm gonna attempt to try to walk down these steps because I'm gonna try to uh, prove my manhood to everyone at home. Mm. You have nothing to prove, man. When you're up against Dave, stuff like this, I'm on the middle of the staircase, dude. And I really, I gotta, I gotta, I think I gotta come back, bro. I mean, Whoa. This is scary. I, we both have been there before. It's so real, man. Like this. This is real, dude. This this stuff is is legit. Mm hmm. Yeah, I gotta f***ing go back. <laughs> and it's completely black. <sighs> Can't do it, man. Can't do it. Wow. Y'all just don't know. You don't know. You don't know until you hear. All of that is just crawling with with afterlife that has not crossed to the other side. And boom. And it's true and it's real. There it is. Yeah, I'm being honest because I'm scared as f I just couldn't do it. We are the last two people left, man. That's last so two. You know? We are the last two, mother. Yeah. It, I don't think it has ever come down to just two people before. It's just real. That's right. This place is, this place is, I mean, I won't even call it haunted. I'll just say that it is full of spirits. Haunted is an understatement. I guess this is it. Game's over, man. Game's over. And this really isn't a game. Right. It's really this not a game. This is far from a game. Damn it. Here, you feel my ass clicking out. You have been removed. No five thousand dollars for you. Bye. So you clicking up? <laughs> and then it just kick. Yeah. Is it no five thousand dollars for you? I mean, Bye. Tells me to do. And I'm out. Hey man. We'll see you, Dave. Yeah. Take care, brother man. Definitely Dave not, is we'll the last you. one. Only one team member remains. Red, open envelope three and follow the printed instructions for your investigation of the Carpinteria. I can't do that. And I will flip out. He is the last contestant. Y'all tell me, would you be able to get through all the rest of those dares by yourself. Ask yourself that. All right, you guys, I'm the last one left. It's only me now, I have no navigator. I have to go by myself from here on out. I mean, I'll tell you the truth, I'm really scared. I'm sitting by myself in the safe house and 
I can't take it. I have nobody. You have been removed. The website has detected that all team members have quit. This investigation has failed. I. Yeah. The investigation has failed. <laughs> no duh. <laughs> so, what do y'all think? You see the reason why this is my favorite episode of MTV Sphere? Because... It really came down to one person. And honestly, with the way things are in that area, the heavy spiritual activity, it was enough to make everybody hightail it and run. Do you really think that you would be able to do it by yourself? Do you think that you would be able to bring it home? <laughs> well, that's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's it for this uh, special edition three-part series here on Saturday Night Chiller. We were watching MTV's Fear. Now, if you want me to go on and watch more episodes of MTV's Fear, please put it in the comments below, and I'll be more than happy to do it. Other than that, we're going to be coming at you next week with some more uh, scary videos, some more scary uh, uh, document uh, uh, documentaries and, and things of that nature right here on Saturday Night Chiller. See you next time. Bye-bye. Thank you for joining me.